That's a very nice figure. Game of Thrones, Khal Drogo. What's going on everyone? Welcome to Mate Zone once again. For today, we're going to unbox this figure and do a little bit of review. So it's the Game of Thrones Legacy Collection 6-inch figure and it's Khal Drogo. Okay, so I bought this one from my private seller and um, I have the rest of it but it's a different uh, I'll make. It's the one with the base but this one here this is the only one that I have on this line right so I bought this um, sometime like two months ago and um, the box has somewhere that's why we're going to unbox it okay I want to share it to you guys what's inside okay it's a very nice figure with a uh, few accessories with it alright guys so just follow me and let's unbox this figure So first of all, before we take it out, let's look at the box. So it's a window packaging. You can see the figure inside and the four accessories or four weapons that came with it. There's no base. And you can see Game of Thrones number 10, Legacy Collection. You can see here the um, logo, Khal Drogo. That's what you see at the side. Legacy Collection. And their HBO at the back, the full figure of Khal Drogo or Jason Momoa was the um, actor. So you'll see here all that you can collect. Jamie Lannister, Brienne of Tart, Arya Hatt Stark, Khal Drogo and Rob Stark and also Daenerys Targaryen. That's what you can see at the side. Top. And the bottom. Sorry, the price was showing, so there you go. It's a good price. Okay, and it was this was manufactured 2014. So let's take it out and I'll show it to you what we have inside, okay? Alright, so let's measure the height. So it's six inches tall, okay? And before we go to the figure, let's take a look at the weapons that came with it. So it came with, first of all, these two uh, knives or daggers. So it's the same, right? So I like the color and the silver, the shape, very nice. And of course, these two here, one small and one uh, big one or longer one, right? I like that it's washed, you can see. This one is black and yeah, I like the, the details and the sculpt with this, you can see that it's washed, very nice. And now guys, the figure, so I like this sculpt very much, it's, I can see that, you know, this one is Jason Momoa, he's the um, actor who acted as the um, Khal Drogo in Game of Thrones you can see here this this scalp on this around his um, waist I think this one here is like gold plated now this skirt nice color wash pants very nice and the paint job here, the tattoo, it's like bluish inside and black on the out, uh, outline. You can see here the ponytails on his goatee. You gotta be careful not to break it. That's a nice well, piece right there. You can see the eyes and the scar here across his left eye. And I like also the scalp here on his hair. Very nicely done. You can see here the um, 
muscle details very good very nice I like it so let's go with the articulation the head it rotates all the way around there and the, a little bit of um, side to side up and down but not much this how far the hand can go it can rotate it doesn't have any bicep swivel here and the elbow this is how far it can go and the um, hands they rotate move up and down there's no there is a waist articulation it may go all or all, all the way back or all, all the way around but I don't want to force it but as you can see it moves side to side up and down a little bit by the way you can see that if you notice it the nipples are coming out which is good right and then this one's here you can see that it's connected it has a upper thigh articulation so you can rotate and double hinge knee that's how far you can go I don't want to force it and you cannot move forward it just stays there and there's no toe articulation but the feet you see that it can move a little bit side to side nothing up there it can't go up and down that's fine and now we'll try to put the um, accessories or the weapons that came with it so I have put all the weapons together so right here you can see that there is a pouch for the knife there and I've kind of had a hard time putting the these two weapons on his arms because it's kind of tight you gotta be careful not to snap the weapons okay but by just looking at it this one here it's kind of pointy right so maybe you go this way and it should look better right all right so there you go guys we did unbox and did a review on this figure game of thrones legacy collection six inch caldrogo i would recommend this to any collectors especially a uh, game of thrones it's a solid figure comes with enough um accessories i guess and I don't have much complaint. I can all see, only see that uh, it's a pretty, pretty decent um, face of Jason Momoa. Though it's not that much, but I, I can see that it's him. <laughs> Alright, no major complaints about this. So I recommend it. Alright guys, so thanks for watching again our video. Leave a comment down below if you'd like like share and subscribe of course right so i'll see you on my next video have a nice day take care